Hi everyone, Anthony Morganti here. If you plan on printing your own images or sending them off to a lab to be printed, I have some advice I'd like to give you. Now this is advice that I've talked about in previous videos and recently I had some of my own images printed and I failed to heed my own advice and it's driving me crazy and I want to talk about it. I have this photo, I took it with my iPhone. This is an actual print that's above my desk. It's a panorama, obviously. It's 60 inches by 20 inches, so it's pretty large. Looks okay. It's printed on canvas. That doesn't matter, though. We're going to zoom in, and I'm going to zoom in on the left-hand side, and you can see that there's this little thing way off in the distance here, and if I look in the right-hand side, you'll see over here is another little thing. What those are, those are birds way off in the distance. And I've mentioned in the past that if you plan on printing, particularly landscape images, that you should go through them very carefully and look for birds that are way off in the distance and get rid of them. Because when you print them, they'll just come out to be little blobs and they look ridiculous. Now, granted, they're really small and probably 99% of the people that look at this print on my wall aren't going to notice them. This is right above my desk. I'm sitting in front of it right now, and it drives me nuts. I'll just look up there, and my eyes immediately go to those little spots off in the sky. So what you should do is before you send the image off to be printed is to zoom in and just drag the image around and try to find, there's another one there, try to find any little birds that are off in the distance. And when you find them, get one of the... Uh, healing tools. I'm going to use the new eraser or healing brush tool here, the content aware remove tool, technically what it's called. And I'll come in and get rid of that one. Hold the space bar in so I could drag over to the other side and I'll get rid of that one. It's too late for me, obviously, because I have this printed and hanging above my desk, but it's not too late for you. Get rid of those things that are off in the distance that are driving you mad. Even something like this, like, who knows what that is? Like, we'll get rid of that too. So, that's it. That's really the only advice I have to give to you today concerning printing your images. Make sure, particularly these landscape images, that you go through them very carefully and get rid of any of those birds that are way off in the distance. Because once you print them, they're not going to look like birds anymore. They're just going to look like blobs of ink. Thank you, everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.